just want to say that Halloween decor hunting takes dedication because it is pouring down rain and my umbrella's in the other vehicle. One of those moving pictures. Moving Hello pictures. there, moving pictures. Uh, every city, every place. Uh, always been a restless girl. Uh, but now there's a window change. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting to find anything. I am so excited. Oh, oh my god, I'm so excited. You have no idea. $9.99. Yay, it actually stopped raining. So we're headed to TJ Maxx and see what they have. Oh my gosh, I'm getting all excited again. So TJ Maxx actually has some also. All right, so this gnome with the bats is $9.99. Okay, he's actually like a cone. Like he's like hollow inside. And these, oh my gosh, these are pretty heavy. It's like felt. $7.99 and okay we have some fall garland I'm gonna show you this fall too this mug $4.99 all right boo ghost $14.99 that's felt and then, yeah, the monkeys see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. And that is $9.99. And then this, well, this is very light. It's not heavy. Oh, it's a light. It's not heavy at all. And $14.99. Oh my gosh. It changes colors. <gasps> Oh my gosh, it changes colors. <gasps> that is really cool. And then we have some Ghostbusters, a teardrop glass, Nightmare Before Christmas. And we have a huge cauldron. Oh my gosh, we have lots. So we have a white one. And then and these are pretty heavy. And then we have a smaller cauldron, $7.99. That's not bad. And the large one's $14.99. $14 you can hear me clattering that stuff. And these, $7.99, a small one. And this one's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, it's so heavy. There's so many. So they all stack different sizes a trick-or-treat with the largest Let's see $14.99 I guess the largest is $14.99 I am so shocked to see Halloween at TJ Maxx and Marshalls and little mini cauldrons set of three buckets um, they're like metal and $12.99 Let's see if Joann's has any Halloween fabric. My Halloween fabric. Darn, and it's not on like most of their 
I've seen a whole bunch of sales signs on their fabric. But, of course, Halloween fabric is not on sale. All right, I need to put my readers on so I can see these more. Wow, this is glow in the dark. The skeletons glow, I guess. We have some skeleton bats and cats. What is that? Oh, palm reader. And what is this one? That looks like cards also, like tarot cards almost. And just some orange yellow trees. Ooh, spooky cat eyes. Oh, I like this one. It's very vintage looking. Day of the Dead, more Day of the Dead. What have we got down here? Ooh, what is this? Whole bunch of stuff going on here. Okay, this is kind of funny. The cat. That is so funny. He looks like petrified, all puffed up. Witches hats. Roses and skulls. Oh, I almost missed this. This is kind of a combo of like mummy maybe with some cat eyes almost. Oh my gosh. Little dogs in costumes. Oh, <laughs> these are really cute cats. Oh my gosh, this dog right here reminds me of Odie from Garfield, doesn't he? What do y'all think? Oh, we got some more vintage look here. I like this. Okay. We got like cobwebs that look, oh, they're in like uh, water globes. That's what these look like. Yeah, definitely water globes. And, ooh, we got a lot going on on this one here. Cats and bats. This just looks marbleized. More marbleized. This looks celestial with the cat and the stars. More like cards going on. Ooh, the Black Widow is kind of creepy. And, um, what is this? This is kind of a lavender background. And the little ghost here with the pumpkins are cute. And we have spider webs with stars and moons. Alright, is that it? Or can we find more? Oh, wait a minute, they are 25% off. Ooh, I might be getting me some fabric. Did I even show y'all this one? That's in like water globes too. And actually, well, ooh, this is creepy. It's just like a spooky forest. Oh, I'm gonna point this out, guys. This right here is Whirlwind Mickey. And did you know that I have a family channel called Life's a Whirlwind? Ooh, I found some like in their everyday section. This looks like it's 30% off. <gasps> and there's another like look at Odie. Is that the same one? Oh, this is a different, um, it has a different feel to it. These are cute little pumpkins. Ja I mean, jack-o'-lanterns. Just skeleton here. This is fun. Oh, and this one's really fun. Okay, I'm terrible with fabrics, but like, oh, I wish I could tell you what. Uh, I think these are more cottony or these are thicker. I love this. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I love this scene. I really, really like this. They're calling it juvenile fabrics and it includes the glow in the dark. Granted, I don't see any glow in the dark. It doesn't say that any of these are glow in the dark web and candy corn not in the Halloween section but it totally could be this is like metallic all these are metallic hmm I found this like on the clearance rack unicorns even the skeletons have unicorns oh my gosh what's this one <gasps> Charlie Brown all right these are these no tie no so throws and I have to show you Pivot, pivot, pivot. And how you doing?
Oh my gosh! So we have a Snoopy fleece throw creeping around. And oh, we have Minnie and Mickey here. Unbelievable. Okay, I'm throwing in the Star Wars one. Beetlejuice. I would be failing you if I did not show you all the Nightmare Before Christmas fabric. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Villains fabric. Did you guys know they had that? And a little, okay. Loving this one. That one's great. And Grateful Dead. And more Jack and Sally and Zero. Oh, I'm in love with this Thanksgiving fabric. I love this little dog. I swear it looks like Odie. I'm gonna check Bath and Body Works now. Now this is a smaller Bath and Body Works, so I'm not holding my breath that they have any Halloween out yet. There were no Halloween candles, but I am going to show you these fall candles. shoot none of the latte well that one's cute though that one's $3.95 I might do that one oh my God. okay I'm gonna do that one then okay you guys ready for it I wanted the pumpkin latte I'll insert a picture of what I'm talking about but they didn't have any more So this little fella was $5.95 and even though the little hand sanitizer is supposed to go in it, I don't use their hand sanitizer, but I think he actually looks adorable right there. I think I'm just going to keep it in here all the time and I might see if I can like, um, I don't know, if I can hang him, I'll see if I can hook him and hang him. We'll see. We'll see. But other thing I got oh my gosh this was the main thing I wanted from Bath and Body Works and that is the vampire chihuahua wallflower this was $14.95 I think because when I he does something special and when I get home I will show you guys but he is so stinking adorable absolutely love it absolutely love it now I did pick up some other Halloween items but I'm actually gonna leave that to my Halloween haul um, I'll end up including this one too for people that like you know did, didn't see this video but we'll see the haul vlog but I just couldn't wait to show you guys today is July 16th the very next day and I'm starting out my search at Hobby Lobby all right, this almost puts Mickey ears to shame. $6.99 turkey legs. Turkeys. Oh, that is pumpkin pie with Cool Whip on top. And, oh yeah, that's the same thing. Quick glance at the fall stuff. Oh my gosh, dogs and a red truck. That is awesome. And look. I love fall most of all. Those are cats though. Okay, just gonna take a quick little little look for fall. As we search for Halloween.
Now the only thing is, this stuff is not on sale yet. Getting a little discouraged here at Hobby Lobby for Halloween merch because I'm pretty sure I'm in the last aisle of fall and I see Christmas stuff already. So a little discouraged. Okay. Definitely gonna get this when it goes on sale. see it out that it lights up inside and then here is the matching one to that redheaded little girl I want to get well obviously Hobby Lobby is skipping Halloween so now I'm off to I'm gonna go back to Marshall's because I'm so close to it I was just there yesterday just saw those couple you know those few things and then I will be off to Cracker Barrel, which I'm pretty sure Cracker Barrel has Halloween items. I prefer to park beside people who I know like to take care of their vehicle so that uh, they will be cautious about opening their doors on mine. Anybody else think about this when they park their vehicle? All right, looks like a few things are gone with nothing new. I haven't been in a big lots and I bet Oh my gosh at least a year and a half maybe two years so you know you never know maybe they have their halloween merch out no luck at big lots and i just realized there's michael's right there so let's give michael's a try it looks like they've started but this is it i've never known them to put halloween stuff in this like first little corner when you walk in like door you walk in right there and this is it so, got a lot of uh, floral picks. Oh, this one says trick or treat. And of course, none of them are on sale yet. This wreath hanger with little uh, jack o' lantern bells. They had these last year, and it had a pink rose in it, like a pastel pink. Ooh, you can do a lot with this. $3.99. Oh, yeah. And the different colored glitter picks. And the witch feet. Well, this one's cute. The little bats. And, ooh. Lots and lots of spiders. I think this could pass as a bracelet. Would I get like lots of stairs, do you think? It's actually really comfortable. So that's it. Not a lot going on right here, but I'm gonna check the rest of the store just in case. I'm really surprised that that's all that Michael's had. I wanna tell you this cute story from when I was in Big Lots. It took me back to when the kids were small. So there was a guy there with two kids, um, probably about five and seven. And the kids were kind of bickering with each other. And finally the dad just stopped the cart. He said, I do not want you two to speak to each other. And they just kind of looked at him. And he's like, do not speak to each other. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I've said that to my kids before. <laughs> like when they just, you know, they were just like bickering back and forth, just testing each other. And it was finally like, don't speak. 
do not talk to each other. Like, I've been there. I've been there. Okay, Cracker Barrel, do me proud. Please do me proud. Yay! We have code orange. We have code orange. <gasps> okay, what have we got? We got a Disney, what is that? Oh, Nightmare Before Christmas shirt. And actually, with this music in the background, I think I'm going to have to um, put voiceover. So here we go. Okay, that was sensor motion sensor activated.
Oh, that's motion censored. These are great. Yes. I love those. Oh my gosh. I asked an employee if they expect any more Halloween merch and she did not know. Oh my goodness, I am so going to be going back to um, Cracker Barrel because there were so many different things I wanted. I am going to show you one thing I went ahead and got because I'm so, they would have probably, it was the only one it would have sold out. Um, but little baby diva. There were so many cute Halloween outfits I want to get her. But I went ahead and got this one because it was the smallest. It was zero to three months, and they only had one. And then it had, you know, the little matching pants. And, you know, it, it doesn't take Cracker Barrel long normally to put their stuff on sale. But I went ahead and paid full price, $21.99. Um, just because I wanted to make sure that... I ended up getting one for, for her. I'm gonna keep looking out for you guys, you know, constantly going to the stores so you don't have to, to find out exactly when the merch is coming out, when it's hit the stores, what's coming out. So make sure you subscribe and hit the bell notification button so you know when those videos come up because, you know, I have so many other types of videos, some that you might, maybe you're not into Ray Dunn, maybe you're not into, you know universal park videos you know there's gonna be stuff books that I'm gonna put up put up Funkos that you might not be interested in but this you are interested in so subscribe see you at the parks yeah. Ooh, yeah. I've been all